This little boy didn't live an easy life, and according to the medical investigator, he died a slow and painful death. Is it possible that Omari's life could have been saved? Objection. The medical investigator said 25% of Omari's blood was in his stomach, that he died from blunt trauma that led to internal bleeding, causing his brain to swell. Omari's little sister, just five years old when she saw her brother killed, testified today via Skype in another room at the courthouse so she wouldn't see the man accused of killing her brother. Can you just have a brother named Omari? Yes. What happened to him? He fought her and then he fought the other brother. Who did him? My dad, a lame the little girl said she came out of her room when she heard screaming that Omari asked her to help him. But the defense said Omari's little sister told investigators she yelled at her mama to stop hurting Omari, to stop spanking him. Then months later, while living with her aunt, she said both parents hurt Omari. Your mama did something mean, so Omari and dad did something like that. Yeah. And that, um, what, mama, what your mama did to Omari was bad. When she finished testifying, Casaus kissed his hand and placed it on the computer screen. Then the jury heard from Stephen Casaus himself, the recorded interview he did with police hours after Omari died. Police asked him about the cigarette burns on Omari's body. The medical investigator testified there was not one, but three cigarette burns on the child. Also in the recorded interview with police, Gisnow said he rarely spanked Omari, that the boy came from a loving home, and Omari, he said, never cried. Back to you. Thank you.